everybody and welcome back to another Dollar Tree haul with me, Margo. Sorry, it's been a little bit. Uh, I've been a little bit busy. School starting up again and back to work full time. And I have come to a decision that I'm going to continue Dollar Tree hauling, but I'm going to cut back a little bit. So I might go to once a week instead of twice a week. And I also want to film a little bit more DIYs. So maybe it'll be one DIY, one Dollar Tree haul, depending on what I find, honestly, at Dollar Tree. Um, and also in this video, guys, um, at some point I will be announcing the Crayola winner. And congratulations to the winner. Also, please send me an email with your address and I will get the products out to you. All right, guys, I want to thank my subscribers. If you are new here, welcome. Um, again, my name is Margo. I do go to multiple Dollar Trees and shop. And I also, um, I like to do clearance shopping as well. But anyways, if you are not subscribed, please consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell. That way you are notified every time I put up a new video. All right, guys, so let's get started. I did need some Worcestershire sauce, so I picked this up. This is a 10 ounce bottle. And here are the nutritional facts for that. And the best by date. I do this all the time. It is 10 29 24. It's right over here. All right. And I saw this. This is shelf stable farmer owned prairie farms there's eight grams of protein whole chocolate milk vitamin d no artificial growth hormones and it's a one quart size here are the nutritional facts and let's see for the expiration march 24 2024 I'm sure it'll be way gone by then. There is quite a bit of sugar in here, though. <clears throat> There's 28 grams of sugar, I believe. Yes. Everything in moderation, right? Okay. I was watching Pookie's View, and she had picked these up. These um, Margaret Holmes Homemade Made Easy Tomato, Okra, and Corn. Real Southern Style. Heart Healthy. And this is a 14.5 ounce can. And here are the nutritional facts. But anyway, she picked them up because she said she was going to put them in beef stew. And I thought, what a great idea. Best by date on these is August 25th, 2025. And I did pick up two of these. Okay, I did find something, well, I think is new. I'd never seen this before. TGI Fridays. Yes, I've seen the chips, but these are crinkle fries, corn snack, chili cheese, naturally artificially flavored, naturally and artificially flavored, 3.5 ounce. <laughs> I'd never seen these before. Here's the nutritional facts. And the best by date is March 25th, 2024. So we'll give those a whirl. Let's see. Is that it for... I think it is. That's it for the food. Alright. So this is Love My Carpet Foaming Carpet Cleaner Spray and Vacuum Self Cleaning Formula. Love this. Okay. This is a 12 ounce can. Normally they are... I'm not even positive, but they're definitely smaller. I'm going to say like 8 to 10 ounce cans. So this is the bigger can. I was happy to find it. So I will uh, give it a whirl. I believe everything is the same. Absolutely. It's just a bigger can. So love that. All right. And then I did find the veggie bags that everybody's been hauling. This is the reusable five pack washable polyester. You get four 11 by 14 bags and one this is the, the small bag right here this is it right here and they're all drawstring and it's by natural home brands pretty cool 
All right. I had seen Twisted Gypsy hauling these a while back, and I, I was hoping to find them. It's a half a pound of rubber bands, and they're assorted. Now, I will be bringing some of these to work, and then some of these I'm going to actually do what she said she was going to do, make a rubber band ball. I might even do that anyways. Make a rubber band ball and then bring it to work. And make a rubber band ball for here. Okay. Um, garbage bags. We needed garbage bags. So I picked them up. This is the, I always look for the bonus. This is the two extra bags. The 30 gallon. I use these in my 13 gallon garbage bag. I mean bucket in the kitchen because um, we take the garbage out and then we'll go around the house and grab all the little garbages and throw them in there. So it works. These are, oh, it fell out. Oh, that's okay. All right. So they had these magnets, character magnets. I did pick up the Mickey one. They also had Minnie Mouse, I believe. And they had Little Mermaid. Mm, and one more. Maybe Paw Patrol? Not positive. But anyways, I wanted Mickey and I've got Mickey and their magnets are so cute. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, it says ten. Oh, ten. There is ten. Awesome. I was very happy about that. Okay, so when my mom and sister were here, my sister was looking for these clips. So I have been looking for them ever since. She did found I think she found one while she was here. I don't know if she has found more since, but I'll send these to her. But I did find two more for her. And I saw this. This is adorable. It's Sassy and Chic Makeup Sponge with Case. And it has like all coffee beans on here. And let me open this up without ruining it. They had this color and then they had a darker like a brown but how cute is this right here's the beauty blender you wet it soak it really good wring it out soak it really good wring it out and then use it wash it again and when you're done you put it in here there's holes on the bottom and there's holes on top that way your blender will dry it won't get all yucky in there and it, over here it does say sassy and chic but guess what you can put it on this side. You can put somebody's name. You can actually, if you don't want to use this as a um, holder for your, your blender, then what you can do is put this on your coffee bar and you can crick it or, or write whatever you want on there. I think that would be adorable. Oops, let me put this back. All right, like I said, there was this color and then there was a brown. Okay. Okay. So, also in the health and beauty, I'm actually, this is going to be one of my baskets. That's another thing. I'm definitely doing these baskets at Christmas time. But, so, Barbasol. This is awesome. I picked up the uh, shaving cream. And this is a four-pack of razors. Then they have the Barber Scissors and Comb. They have the two size for the um, nail clippers. And then they have the tweezers. So I think this will make an awesome basket. Definitely. And I honestly believe this would be a great gift to give to the homeless shelter. Not a bad idea. Maybe with a toothbrush and toothpaste. All right. So then for the bathtub, um, I am going to make a bathtub... Um, basket as well at Christmas time for a young child in my life and I picked up these to go along with them the cocoa melon it's create fun in the tub and these are just like little sponges that I believe you wet them and you can stick them to the wall bath playtime activity yep it's uh, foam pieces so we have cocoa melon and we have a uh, paw patrol and here's the back they also had uh, Minnie Mouse and Gabby's Dollhouse, I think. Not 100% sure if that's what it's called, but I think it is. Okay. And then I saw these, actually, I just saw these today. These are unicorn slap bracelets, and you get six of them in here. 
So I am definitely for Halloween, I'm making up little bags and buckets. So um, I have actually four girls. So here's six that I, I'll be putting in the buckets. Um, we needed a new scraper with the blade and this is five blade blades included from Toolbench, I believe. Yes, it is by Toolbench. And it is distributed by Greenbrier. These things I was really hoping to find. These are sensory toys, stress relief, puzzle, puzzle chain. And it's these little beads that you can manipulate in different ways. You can probably, I mean, if your hand is small enough, a little girl can, or boy, you can put their hand through there and make it a bracelet. Here are some of the puzzle um, designs you can do with it. And this is distributed by Greenbrier, so hopefully everybody will be getting these. Pretty cool, right? But I did get the girls each one for um, to put in their Halloween bags. I should have picked up two more for the other two girls. If I find them again, I definitely will. Let's see. Let's, let's look at some Halloween stuff. So I needed one eyeball <laughs> for the Hocus Pocus uh, spell book that I'm working on. Um, I did buy a book from Dollar Tree, and I, I'm going to have all that in another video. But anyways, I needed one eyeball. I got to cut it in half and I think I'm going to cut my eye, cut it in half and uh, I'll show you guys. I've been filming as I do work on the projects that I'm working on and we'll put it all together and put it out for you guys. All right. And as you guys know, I'm doing the Hocus Pocus theme. So I did see these, what are they calling these decor, but they have so many different styles. I think there was three different styles and then there was one that was like a chalkboard so you could write or draw whatever you would like on it or you can i mean this side there's a lip to it this side there isn't you can always paint the other side or do what you want with it actually and then let's see some more halloween stuff uh, i got these two for the girls and what i'm telling you i should have just gotten four so anyways these two right here these are spooky princess sticker face they come with the stickers there's also a um seek not seek and find here's the stickers and then there's also stickers in the back oh i believe spot the difference i believe there's a spot the difference for um halloween that i am looking for for the girls they love those and I know that the oldest one is getting a little bit older. I mean, if she doesn't want to do this, she can pass it on to her sister. And here's the other one. So I did pick up those for the girls. And my son was with me and he wanted these. I'm going to take care of the inside. Actually, I'm probably just going to decorate the bathroom and the living room. And my husband and son will decorate the outside. So DJ did pick up these two for leaves we have plenty of those and i believe there's a pack where there's just one um or maybe this is the leaf bags okay this is the 12 by 30 by 12 i believe there's a yeah two piece i believe there's a one piece package that's um actually bigger than that okay and i was very 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 excited to find these they look like real books um I forgot who it was. I had seen someone. Her name will come to me. Jody's Craft Room. She popped it open and it wasn't that hard. And it looks like a box inside. I mean, you can always glue it back. I'm not going to pop mine open. But look at that. Really, really, really cool. Really cool. This one is Crystal Magic. This one is Secrets of the Stars. This is awesome. Even if you wanted to. And the last one is mastering yeah that word so i mean even if you wanted to if you're not a big halloween fan you can always paint these and decoupage them make whatever you want with them you can have your book stacking like this and have whatever words you want in them so or like this so 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 cool love these 
love, love, love. Actually, I should have gotten two sets so I can keep one for Halloween and then paint another. You know what else we can do? <laughs> we could paint these. We could decoupage these with, let's say you're doing a birthday gift for somebody and it's their seventh birthday. You put their picture here, number seven here, pop it open and have pictures of them from birth to seven in here. I mean, it's a thought. You could do one for every year. Okay, onward. All right, so these car window clings, awesome. These are eight inches. And you know what? I'm going to open this. Oh, wait a minute. I'm going to open this, but I'm not 100% sure if I want to bring these to work or if I actually want to use them. Okay. All right. So that's pretty cool. So it's just like a big sticker. It is absolutely. Oh, it's clear. Awesome. 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 Maybe I'll save one. I know my husband. He'll probably want to put one in his car. Or his truck, I should say. All right. So there, there's the mummy. And then we have the, I'm going to show you guys the back, the skeleton. And then we have this, looks like Grim Reaper. This one's pretty cool. <laughs> Bet you my husband will want that one. All right. So those are really cool. I like those. I like those a lot. All right couple books um this one is a complete guide to nature's surprising superfood the healing power of coffee includes dozens of helpful recipes and home cures this book is a wake-up call to show coffee and emerging ancient remedies is now the newest health food oh i didn't even have to pull the sticker up but i did okay so, um, this was $15.95 outside of Dollar Tree. And, of course, I paid $1.25. And here you go. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I'm going to be sending this to one of my sisters. Um, the one that lives in Florida. She's a huge coffee fanatic. So, all right. And then the other big book I picked up, I think my oldest niece is going to love this. Magic the Gathering. I believe that is a card game, kind of like, I think, like Yu-Gi-Oh! or something. Um, a War of the Sparks Forsaken. And here we go. And let's see. This sold for $27 outside of Dollar Tree. And I will take off the dust jacket. Pretty cool. And it's got purple on it. I know some people like to use these to stack up or put on their shelves. So, that's a pretty cool book. I was excited about that. All right, and these last three items are some awesome, cool, la-di-da socks. <laughs> so, I did find these, and they're two packs. It says right here, two pairs. They actually staple two together. And these are la-di-da's. These are so, so cool. These are um, size medium. Does it say? Ladies shoe size 6 to 10 and a half. Okay, so they have the owl on one side and the fox on the other. These actually feel very nice too. They do. So they have this one. Then they had this one. This is so cute. Again, mediums. Uh, a shoe size 4 to 10 and a half. Sock size 9 to 11. And these have all puppies on them. Let me see if there's a, um, a price on these underneath. Oops, I think I pulled it right off. Yeah, I did. I pulled it right off. Oh, well. So I didn't even look these up online either, but they are la di da. And then the last two pairs I have, these are so cute. Look at their they're giraffe. <laughs> that is adorable. I know someone that their favorite animal is a giraffe, so these are gonna be going to her. All right, guys. So that is it for my haul. Um, I hope you guys have 
your wish list going and you added to it and um good luck again to uh, not good luck i'm sorry congratulations again to the winner please don't forget to leave me your address so i can get your products out to you and again you guys until next time love you bye